In the last video, I was talking about the advantages of short line when teaching and learning to kitesurf. After posting, I got several requests regarding how to make them shorter. For me, the best is to have a bar with short lines already made so we can use it. But a lot of people didn't have that or didn't want to cut and make short lines. In this video, I will cover how to make short lines with the bar you have and the pros and cons of each method. One way is folding the lines. For that, all you need is three pigtails. Let me show you how to do this. If you haven't already subscribed to our channel, now's the time to do so. Click the subscribe button and activate the notifications to find out when the next video comes out. Also, leave a comment in the comment section as it's always great to hear from you. To fold the lines to shorten them, we need to create an attachment point at the same height. It usually is more accessible in the bars with low V as the pre-lines and the trim system end at the same point. On bars with high V, this is a lot harder because the pre-lines, the V or the trim are not at the same height. It is still possible to do this, but a lot harder. I don't particularly like the high V bars and I don't have one. So I'll focus on the most common one, the low V. On the connection between the pre-lines and the flying lines, you usually have a loop-to-loop -loop connection. Open it. Then it depends on our other end. It can be a line with a removable pigtail that is the most common now, or a sewn one that makes it more tricky. I'll focus on the most common one. If it's a removable pigtail, you can either install a pigtail, making it a fast connection, or fold the lines and do a loop-to-loop, -loop, creating a cleaner connection. Then fold the lines and reinstall the pigtail on the other end. For the center lines, we have to be careful not to create problems with the safety line. Often, they pass on the center of the bar in a tight space, so we can't make it that it jams. The best is to create an attachment point on the trim point at the same distance as the side lines. Then pick up the two center lines and attach them to that point without the pigtails. The removable pigtails are once again reinstalled at the top of the folded line. Always check if the safety system still works smoothly. This method makes the lines folded, so you get eight lines connecting the kite. The line drag is superior to the usual four lines. You can even fold this one more time. I'm not too fond of this method personally. I prefer to prepare the lines before by cutting them and having extensions to the size that I want. If you don't know how to do this, check the video on how to make loops on the lines. I'll link the video on the description and on the top corner of this video, right here. That I know of, only North Kiteboarding has sectioned lines allowing you to change quickly from full length to half length. This is perfect for teaching and I hope more brands follow this. I would even break the lines in three different pieces. This also helps if you break a line, as you only need to replace one part. I hope this is helpful for you to make your bar have short lines and be usable for lessons or learning in the safest and best way. If you have a different system that I didn't cover, send me a comment below and I'll try to help out. Glad you're here and I'll see you on the next video.